Hey guys, Spina Dude here and welcome back to another video. Today guys, we're going to be taking a look at another 2018 Safari LTD figure for the hashtag How I Safari campaign. So let's have our co-host Marvin bring it out. Thank you, Marvin. So today, guys, we are finishing up our look at the 2018 Safari LTD prehistoric range with this guy. It is the 2018 Safari LTD Triceratops. I am so excited to be able to take a look at this fan favorite figure today. We have reviewed all of the other 2018 figures from Safari LTD on the channel, so if there's any one that you want to see, you can go check it out on the Safari LTD playlist on the channel. So without further ado guys, let's dive straight into the review. Before we take a closer look at the figure, here are a few quick facts about Triceratops itself. Triceratops horridus means horrid three-horned face. It was a ceratopsian from the Cretaceous period of what is now North America. Triceratops is one of the most famous dinosaurs, hardly needing an introduction. It was one of the largest ceratopsians, growing up to about 30 feet long with a massive head and frill equipped with three intimidating horns. Triceratops lived alongside the tyrant lizard Tyrannosaurus rex, potentially getting into conflicts with the most famous of the carnivorous dinosaurs. So without further ado guys, let's start taking a closer look at this awesome horned herbivore. Alrighty guys, so here is the 2018 Safari LTD Triceratops. And I have to say for first impressions, what a beauty. What a beauty. This is just such a gorgeous and majestic piece. And this has to be one of the most visually appealing Triceratops figures that I've seen out there. But why don't we dive in and have a closer look at the actual sculpt work and detail that's been put into this figure. So zooming in on the body here, you can see these beautifully sculpted scales all across the body, very nicely done. I like how all of them are different sizes and have different jagged edges and such. There's also some nice wrinkles and folds in the skin between the two limbs there. And on the underbelly, you can also see a nice pattern of scales getting smaller towards the bottom of the neck there. The limbs have very nice toned musculature as well. And you can see on the front feet, three of the five digits are painted in a dark gray color. Um, and on the back, you can see there are four digits which are painted in a dark gray color. And I really like the posing of the limbs as well. I especially like the front right limb on the Triceratops here. I really like the way that one looks. And the limbs really capture just how large this animal was as well. You can see that they are carrying quite a weight to them. The tail is nicely sculpted as well with a little flick off to the side. I also like the way the colors are blended into each other across the body. I think that's very nicely done. We'll touch more on the colors later on in the video, of course. But here is my favorite part of this entire figure, which is the beautiful head sculpt. And this head and the face just captures Triceratops perfectly. The frill has some really nice yellow markings there that really make the head stand out. I also really like the bony edges on the frill. And of course the horns are done very nicely as well. These are done in a uh, tan color. You can see the two very long brow horns and of course the one shorter nasal horn there. I also really like how the beak is done. You can see it has some really nice curvature to it. And the interior of the mouth has been sculpted and painted in a fleshy pink color. It is quite hard to see in there though, but you can see the tongue and I quite like the positioning of the tongue. It looks like this Triceratops is roaring at something. And you can also see the nostrils have been carved out and painted in a glossy black color. Same with the ears. If you look under the frill here, you can see the ears have been carved out in the back and those are painted in a uh, glossy black color as well. But overall, just the head sculpt here, expertly done, absolutely gorgeous. Now for the colors on this figure, I thought that this was quite a simple color scheme when I saw that they released the images, and I wasn't crazy about it, but now that I have it in hand, it is just beautiful, it is stunning. Uh, I really like, you have like this black color throughout the body. There's even some hints in the, in the right kind of lighting. You can see how there's some hints of like a, a dark, faded pine green where the uh, black transitions into the 
tan color for the underbelly. Uh, that's mainly on the body over here, but the head is mostly black as you can see. I really like the orange eyes as well, those stand out very nicely. And of course we have the uh, faded yellow markings on the frill. I will say the markings on the frill maybe could have been blended a little bit nicer. But I think they're fine, and for the price of this figure, this figure is very reasonably priced, I have to say, for its overall size and everything, and its weight. Also, the pose is quite dynamic, but quite relaxed at the same time. This Triceratops almost looks alarmed, and it looks like it's about to confront something, perhaps a T-Rex, like you could put the Safari Feathered T-Rex next to this guy. But yeah, just beautiful posing here, really nice coloration, and really nice sculpt overall. Alright, so why don't we give this figure a quick measure, so Marvin, why don't you bring out the ruler? Thank you, Marvin. Alright, we've got our trusty flexi ruler now, so in terms of the length from the tip of the tail to the tip of the snout, we're looking at about 8 inches, which is about 21 centimeters. And in terms of the height at the highest point, which is the top of the horns on the head here, we are looking at about 4 inches, which is about 10 centimeters. For comparison, here is the 2018 Safari LTD Triceratops next to the 2017 Safari LTD Feathered Tyrannosaurus Rex. Now these were intended to be developed in the same scale, so they are very close to how these two would have scaled up to each other in real life. So you can recreate some awesome Hell Creek dinosaur battles with these two. And I just think overall these two figures look very nice next to each other. And I'm gonna bring out the feathered T-Rex so I can bring in a menagerie of Safari LTD Ceratopsians. So we have the 2015 Safari LTD Nazudo Ceratops, the 2017 Safari LTD Ineosaurus, and the 2018 Safari LTD Regali Ceratops. And I need to position these a little bit different so you can see all of them mostly. There we go. And one thing I really like is how Safari is continuing this trend of making a new Ceratopsian figure every single year. And same with their sauropods, they've been sticking to making a new sauropod figure or two every single year. 2018, we got two Ceratopsians and two sauropods. We got the Amargosaurus and the Malawisaurus for the sauropods, and we got the Regali Ceratops and the Triceratops for the Ceratopsians. I think it's really cool to have all of these up next to each other. I think the Triceratops looks the best out of all of these just because the coloration is so unique in comparison to the typical grays and browns that we've had from all of Safari Ceratopsians over here. And of course the Triceratops is much larger than any of these other Ceratopsian figures. But I think it's really cool because it stands out next to the other Ceratopsians as the fan favorite Triceratops. And for my overall rating on this figure, I think this 2018 Safari LTD Triceratops deserves 5 stars out of 5. A legendary rating. I really have no nitpicks or complaints with this figure at all. I mean, if I had something to say, maybe the markings on the frill could have been blended a little bit better into the paint scheme, but other than that, nothing that really stands out. This figure is absolutely gorgeous and is without doubt my favorite Triceratops figure that I've seen. It is just beautifully done. So great job Safari LTD. You guys really deserve a round of applause for this one. Well there we go guys, that was today's look at the 2018 Safari LTD Triceratops. I think this figure is absolutely fantastic, and if you guys want to get this one for yourself, you can go to Amazon.com slash SafariLTD, or go to SafariLTD.com, and also use the coupon code SPINODU, that's S-P-I-N-O-D-U-D-E, to get 10% off your next order. So anyway guys, I hope you have enjoyed my look at the entire 2018 Safari LTD range. If you did, leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel. Also leave a comment telling me what you think of this Triceratops figure. So thank you so much guys for watching, and as always I will see you in my next video. Take care, and bye bye